My friend once told me, wouldn't it be awesome to be able to make instant ice? Well, actually, I have an answer for him. Check this out. Today, I'm going to be making instant ice. I know it may sound crazy, but it's going to happen. I have three water bottles, and I'm going to put them in the freezer for three hours. One, yeah, the second one, and the third one. And they have to be evenly separated, or else it might not work. Okay, it's been three hours now, so I'm going to take one of the water bottles out. And as you can see, it's still liquid, but it should like um, it's just before freezing, and it probably needs a little bit, let's say 10 to 15 minutes more in the freezer. But that's why I got other, uh, two other bottles. Uh, we're gonna see if this can instantly freeze. Okay, it's cold enough. Let's see if we can make it automatically freeze. It's frozen and it's freezing. Look at that. It's completely frozen. Look at that. It's ice, guys. Here we are with an almost frozen water bottle. The water is still liquid, but it's way below. Uh, zero degrees so I'm gonna open it carefully because any little um, any little movement could uh, actually make it freeze so carefully we're gonna carefully put it here so as you can see it's completely liquid we're gonna put a small ice cube and see how it freezes. It's completely frozen. The ice cube stayed in there. So, I'm gonna actually put it here too. Put it in this glass here. And I'm gonna put this one like this. Look at that. It freezes completely. And what if I do this? It, can, it makes instant slushy. With it, it, it it's consistent. It, it's it's like a like a snowball. It's completely edible. And it tastes awesome. For for it, it, it's awesome for a refreshing summer. Here, I have a super cold water bottle, and it's gonna instantly turn into ice. It just needs a little help. It's solid ice. The explanation to this is very, very simple. When the water goes down to, to a temperature lower than zero degrees, the molecules start to move less and gather together. The molecules are always moving. Any unexpected external force like shaking the water or dropping an ice cube in, into the water will actually make a crystal and soon many molecules will stick to that crystal 
and expand until everything is frozen. The drawing on the left represents water at less than zero degrees and the drawing on the right represents water that is frozen. Instant ice. Well, now you know how to make instant ice. Of course, keep in mind that the time you leave your bottles in the freezer may change depending on the temperature of your freezer. Anyways, if you like this video, drop a like down below. It will really, really help me. And uh, watch this video as many times as you want and share it with your friends.